the writer of Hebrews, calling the word of God good. It is able to work out good in you. It is able to do good things in you. The purpose of the word is for good. Now it is that our salvation, God has worked his goodness in you. You are natured after his goodness. You have benefited from his goodness. Now what, what does God's word do? It works it out. It brings it out. It makes it come out. You know, that's the goodness of God's word. That's the goodness of God's word. Say, God's goodness has come to me. God's goodness has come to me. God's goodness has come to me. Now, if you have received of God's goodness in his word, just begin to worship God. Just bless the Lord for his word. Just bless the Lord for his word. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Of this world. 
changed by his love. The truth of his word is changing everything. But all it is has changed. Our choices align. As the past has, he's making us a new. We are men.
drenched in their mess. See, that is why we cannot keep quiet when we hear of falsehood. That is why we cannot keep short. Because God wants the world changed. So that which he has worked in you by his word, he wants to work same in others. Sometimes we go for evangelism and some persons will tell us, ah, this Christianity is hard. I've tried, it's not working. And you ask them, what's the problem? It's all conduct focused. That man needs the word. That man needs the truth. The same way we too need it. The same way we too are eating from it. That same man needs it. So we cannot keep short. Now it is that good word works in us patiently. It's okay. A person will say, so best is in, they get it better. They are falling down a speed lane. Why some persons they are falling? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. God is not, is not in a rush. He will take you step by step. So what? What? If you if you did training and you did not graduate with others, or it seems those you are in training with have gone ahead, calm down. <laughs> God's word is working. God's word is right there to help. So come, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down, and trust the word. He's working in us patiently. He's working in us. Don't, don't kill yourself because you are calling. Ah, don't kill yourself because it seems like, ah, ah, sister this, brother this, he has one ahead of me. What's happening to me now? Ah, and because of that, you leave the church. It's what so? You don't, because you don't know what you face out there. It's better you stay. It's better you stay. You heard of Onesimus, the man that did battle with his master. And later on, he became a help to Paul. <laughs> that you are struggling now today doesn't mean you will not be a pastor tomorrow. Ah, you will get better, eh? And you will change others by the world. You will change others by the world. So God is working in you personally. Personally, as you give himself to his word, as you give himself to his word, as you give himself to his word, just lift your hands. As you give himself to his word, personally, 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 just open your heart to God's word. Just open your heart to God's word, personally. God's word is working in you, personally. God's word is working in you patiently. God's word is working in you patiently. God upon no toll, see the man of day. In the no see the lake, Calamondo. It may take two years, it may take two years, it's awesome if you are fast. But it may take two years, but you are in this journey with God. It's working in you patiently. Open your heart to his word. Open your heart to his word. <laughs> Open your heart to his word. And receive help. <laughs> receive God's supply. Receive God's supply. Receive God's supply. <laughs> receive God's supply. Receive God's supply. Some of you will be expressing that. As you're opening God's word and reading, you'll just be seeing God's supply. It shall be seeing God's supply. It's, it's going to be a smooth ride in His word. In His word. <laughs> he will never give up. He'll never give up. That's the good news. Your neighbor giving up on Yum. 
count the blessing that you will have to repeat a phrase over and over again and Pastor Joy will not kick you out and say don't do it again <laughs> and you think you know God patiently working with you it's God that's God that's our good father that's our good father that's our good father that you repeat a phrase over and over again that's our good father working in you saying that I see you can be better I see you can do it I see you can do it I see you can be better there is something I see in you I want to work out so I don't give up I don't say I'm not doing it again ah, this training show is too much for me no I continue ah, a man that continues is a blessed man that's what Luke 11 told us he's a blessed man <laughs> He's a blessed man. Oh, Kalata Salaman, oh, dear. Oh, thank you, Lord, for your patience. Thank you, Lord, for your patience. Thank you, Lord, for your men who are patient with us. Thank you for your word, which never fails. <laughs>
because it makes me better. I'll be always at your table, fixing up your work, learning up the work. Just one more time. I'll be always, I'll be always at your table, fixing on your work, fixing on. It's a seed that is growing in my life. It's fruitful in my life. My Christian work is better. My love work is better. My ministry is better. And it's just because of one thing. The word of God. The word of his power. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen.